Okay, so I've got a question here uh, from Mr. Clift. Um, it's good to talk to you, buddy. Uh, if, if you didn't know this, uh, Mr. Clift and I uh, have known each other a long time since university. And uh, he's one cool cat. And he has played in my band with Bella, a group that I was in some time ago, and uh, also with me. So we, we go way back and um, be good to him because he's a cool dude. So the question is, um, could I talk about nerves, performance, anxiety, and how I cope with that? Um, and techniques that I might have for being able to get up there and pump out amazing performances without feeling scared. Well, I'm going to tell you, I, um, I always feel a bit scared and I always have performance anxiety. I think the key is not trying to hide it or control it more than not trying to put it in a little box and squish it down because that doesn't work. I think what you should do what has worked for me um, is to think about deep breathing, to think about the good stuff you're about to do and to use it in a positive way. Um, to pretend that it's not there, to, you know, that old saying about uh, think that, you know, look out and pretend the audience is naked and what have you. Um, to me, that's just a strange <laughs> weird icky thing to do you know I, I don't think that works I think what works best for me is taking time before my performances to warm up to be really prepared in what I'm doing as much as I possibly can so the more prepared I am the less nervous I am because you know you go out there yes you have that adrenaline rush you take a deep breath and then it becomes muscle memory so the nerves are far less um, I guess in control they're not as nasty and I don't know if you noticed but on my blind audition when George turned around I did not expect that so fast and just seeing his face it smile at me um, it threw me and the nerves came over me because it's extremely nerve-wracking and before that moment I was just I had myself in the right zone I was like I'm just singing for a bunch of people here it's not Kelly Rowland it's it's not George. It's it's not Delta and Seal. No 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 no. Just singing for some people. So I I had that in my mind, and then when he turned around, the reality of the reality TV show hit me again, and I kind of lost it a little bit. I got a little bit, ah, and then I just took another deep breath, and I focused back in, and I went back to that muscle memory and feeling in the moment. So I guess that's the best advice I can give you. Practice really hard. Practice being on stage. So don't just practice in your room and go, oh, yeah, that'll be right. You know, don't get it right once. Practice getting it right and practice being on stage in your mind. So take yourself there and practice your songs without stopping. That's my advice. Like practice them as if you're on stage and if something goes wrong, you got to just make out like that was meant to happen. I've done that so many times.